with that, I'm going to go to my first Skype question seat, uh, Jackie Nesprawl from NBC6 in South Florida. Jackie. Good afternoon. On behalf of the viewers of South Florida, thanks so much for this opportunity. You know, a lot of focus on foreign affairs this week and new sanctions announced today against Iran. And of course, Miami, as you know, is home to the largest Cuban-American community in the country. And during the campaign, President Trump talked about his discontent with the warming of U.S.-Cuba relations implemented by President Obama. And in the last days of his administration, he ended the wet foot, dry foot policy, leaving thousands of Cubans in limbo. So my question is twofold. A, has there been any contact between your administration and the Cuban government? And B, are there any plans to change the current policy right now? Thanks, Jackie. Um we are in the midst of a full review of all U.S. policies towards Cuba. Uh, the President is committed to a, 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 an agenda of ensuring human rights uh, for all of citizens throughout the world. And as we review uh, those policies in Cuba, that will be forefront uh, in, the, in their policy discussions. But there's nothing that we have on that front at this point. Francesca Chambers.